Hello there gamers, I'm the Ninja, and today we're back again with another episode of Don't Star. We're playing as Wes, and frankly, I am really coming to love Wes and his ability to look through his balloons. Look at the balloon! Look at the balloon, Wes, it's in your face! Alright, sweet, I, I really do love those balloons, though. That is just the greatest thing ever. D perfect, perfect mob distraction. Um, alright, so, um, last episode we messed around with some pigs. We explored most of this world because of the fact that I couldn't get that, uh, copying the save over to work exactly. Um, and frankly, I don't think it's possible for me to get the files back because it Don't Starve, uh, overrided them, and those that was the only copy I have. So, it is partially my fault as well. Um, there might have been another way to do it, but frankly, I didn't know of it, so I... I don't know. I don't know. And now I'm just revealing that I'm a terrible person. Alright, but anyways, I really do like playing as Wes anyways, though, because he's freaking awesome. I mean, he's just great. He he can blow balloons. It doesn't get better than that. There's not a single way it can get better than that. The only thing that could make it better is if the balloons, standing by the balloons, made you regain sanity. That, that would be amazing right there. Although, you know, the balloons, they are somewhat, they're somewhat ominous and creepy, so, you know, maybe, maybe that does make sense for them not to help you regain sanity or anything like that um all right but right now we're just getting an outline of the islands so that we can know exactly what we have to explore as we do usually um hopefully we can find some beefalo today and start setting up our camp but i don't think i'm, I'm not too concerned with that right now i'm just mainly concerned with getting an outline of everything so that we know exactly where everything is and we can know exactly what we're dealing with um it looks like we're dealing with a pretty big world here but you know it seems like it's all pretty compact so um, it's not it's not extremely spread out which is always nice because I love having worlds that don't like linger off in giant long paths in random directions it's nice to have it all clumped together uh, that doesn't happen very often um, alright, so, news, 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 news what is today? today is, uh, today? today is a day a day where things happen I don't, I well, I'm trying to think things through in my head. Um, I, I, the entire time I've been recording this session, um, I've been thinking I would upload this on Saturday, but now that I think about it, we're doing a Don't Starve stream on Saturday, so this is actually going to go up on Sunday. Um, now, it's not an entirely Don't Starve stream, but it's our weekly stream, and, you know, the video from Saturday is the uh, video for that. The, the, the video for the live stream is the video for Saturday, and then I don't typically upload on Sunday, so this will actually be Monday, now that I think about it. Haha, -ha, I figured it out. Um, alright, I'm gonna have to work that out. I don't know, I'm trying to figure out exactly which, which what goes where, which day, all that kind of junk. So, it, it's kind of complicated, but I'll figure it out. Um, so it doesn't really concern you guys. Just enjoy, just sit back and enjoy this episode of Don't Starve. Um, I did actually see that tall bird we went by up there. I didn't feel like messing him with him right now, because frankly, we have no weapon, um, really to use against him, so that probably wouldn't be our smartest move. Um, so yeah, we didn't mess with him at all. Alright, so what should we do? We need to set up a base. Let's go ahead and find ourselves a buttload of grass. Um, I think we're actually going to go ahead and sleep. Well, no, we can't actually do that because we can't prototype anything. Never mind, we can't sleep. Um, we'll just grab a bunch of food then and keep on walking until it is forcing us to go to sleep because, you know... Sometimes it does that. Um, I feel like this is actually going to be a good place to set up our camp. And perfect timing, too. There we go. we got plenty of trees to chop down. Got a little bit of grass that we can uh, pick right there. And we also got some flint and some twigs. So, good, good place to waste the night away. Um, Alright, so, in other news, the Pixel live streams are going great. And they're probably over by the time that I'm saying this. Actually, there might be one more by the time that I upload this, I believe. Uh, she might have one on Monday. So, if you guys want to stop by for that. I'm actually gone by the time I upload this, I believe. Um, so there's no more talking to me, but you can go talk to Prescription Pixel, which, you know, that would be very nice of you to go and stop by that and share the indie love for the indie games, and yeah, it'd just, it'd just be a cool thing. And in fact, I'm probably going to join in on that live stream. Um, not that one, the, the one I, I'm confusing you, I'm confusing you, um, but the one, I'm recording this on Thursday, so that, that, the Thursday one, I'm about to join in on that in about, um, 30 minutes or so, so yeah, I'm excited for that, although it doesn't pertain to you whatsoever, although you can head over to Prescription Pixels live streams, I believe, or Prescription Pixels channel, I believe, she's going to be uploading all of the live streams, which is very, very nice, that you guys can see exactly what I do in those live streams, and, you know, 
know, see me hunting after, or longing after, I should say. Not exactly hunting, because I very rarely see it. But hunting, or longing after a blue glowing fox. Um, if you go and watch through all the way through that, I'm sure that you will understand. Uh, it's, yeah, that probably doesn't make any sense whatsoever. I'm throwing you for a loop. Alright, um, balloons, balloons. I want to blow another balloon, but I know that it's going to take our sanity down. That's okay, because we got flowers. Blow a balloon. What do we got? Yeah, it's a piggy. We got piggy balloons. This is our crumbs, alright? Um, you know, we got, those are our crumbs. If you understand, I don't even remember what their names are. Uh, who freaking left the... Who left the crumbs? I know it was Gretel. Is it Hanson? I think it was Hanson. Hanson and Gretel. That sounds. That sounds right. It's something like that. I'm pretty sure. But they left the crumbs. I leave the the balloons. Um, in the hopes that mobs won't uh, pop my balloons. But you never know. All right, let's go ahead and put our garland on. Yeah, we will make West look like a little pretty girl. Hey, pick a 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 p
Wait, could that have been one? There it is! See, I'm a genius. I know how mandrakes generate. Haha, -ha, I found you. Come to me. Aha, you're dead. Alright, um... Let's see, let's see. Man, now if we find any more mandrakes, they're gonna be dancing and singing all night long. Hmm, that's not very exciting. I'm not looking forward to that all that much. Um, alright, I think that is pretty much the basic outline of this area. There doesn't seem to be much else out here, but we'll go ahead and walk back over here so that we can have it on the map. That way I don't come back over here when I forget uh, that there was nothing else out here. Because I do tend to do that. Just saying, I do do that. Um, I do do that. Oh, snap, I went there. Alright, um, let's go ahead and make ourselves a grass suit. Wait, no, no, no. Yeah, go, uh, let's get some grass before we do that. That way we have enough grass for a fire and I'm not being stupid. Because, frankly, that always sucks when I do things like that. Um, okay, go away, spider. Ah, the band, the band Drake. He's going to be dancing and singing all night long, but that's okay. Do it again. Beeflo! How's it going, Beeflo? Alright, sweet. There are Beeflo there, actually. That's pretty cool. Um, Alright, we gotta go up here. I want to find a place to set up our campfire so that we can sing with our little mandrake buddy. Look at him walk. He's so cool. He really is the coolest. He is the coolest of men. Alright, spiders. I don't care for you whatsoever. Oh, great. A giant swamp land. Should have seen that coming. Dang it, I hate swamps. We're not going to get an outline of the swamp land, by the way. We are not going to do that, because I hate them. So we're going to kind of cut it off at the edge of the swamp, and we'll go back to the swamp once we're more prepared and have the ability to revive ourselves at least once, because, you know, I don't, I don't like this. I don't like that sound. The sound of the swamp. It's not a good sound. Alright, but we have an outline of pretty much everything now. I feel like this isn't going to go on too far, but then again, it could go on the, all the way down here. Um, so I could be totally wrong about that, but hopefully I won't be this time. Hopefully it'll be really small and we can just walk through it in one night. Alright, let's go over here. Let's get up here. Um, stick our campfire right there. There we go. Hey, hey, I want you to face the camera. Come over here. Come up here. <laughs> Defeat him! <laughs> oh, it's great! It's great! Yes! You sing! You sing! Ha, uh, no, no, no! You sing! You sing, you mandrake! I want to. I want to examine you. That is exactly what he looks like. That's exactly it, Wes. You got it nailed right there. <laughs> oh man, oh man. Alright, um, let's eat some food because we're about to start dying. <laughs> That's just freaking awesome. Man, Drake, stop it. You're being obnoxious now, okay? It was cool for a little bit, but now it's just obnoxious. Okay, no, it's still wonderful. Do it more, do it more, man, Drake, more. <laughs> Alright, um, as soon as daytime comes, though, he'll, of course, uh, die off, so we don't have to worry about that too much. I did forget to get that grass, though. Um, I don't know what I was thinking. Actually, no, we're good. There we go. Got ourselves that. That should help us if we get into a fight or anything like that, and it makes us look prettier, you know. Um, Mandrake jumping over our head. <laughs> That's great. That is great, Wes. That is wonderful. Mandrake! Mandrake, shut your face! Shut up! <laughs> oh, that's great. Um, alright, let's go ahead and over it over here. Um, you could actually have those mandrakes as a pet. Next time we find a mandrake, or if there's one still left over there, we're totally gonna get one as a pet, you know what I mean? Um... The way that we'll do it is we'll pick it, we'll travel by night, and then uh, we'll keep traveling by night. We'll have to travel by night every single time, otherwise, you know, he'll just die. So we have to travel uh, at night time, so... That's how we'll do it. That's how we'll do it right there. Um, it's going to be awesome. We're going to have a pet mandrake. And then whenever we want a dancing mandrake at nighttime, we can just have a party with our balloons and the dancing mandrake and all the music in the disco rave. That's going to be a glorious party right there. That is going to be wonderful once we do that. Um, I wish I could v revive these mandrakes now so that we could just do that super easily. Uh, but I cannot do that, sadly. Maybe I'll just spawn one in. I know it's kind of cheating, but frankly, it's not like I'm going to eat it. I just want it purely for the awesomeness of having a dancing mandrake at your rave party. Because, you know, it doesn't get better than that. It just doesn't, you know. Dancing mandrake rave party. Best thing ever. 
Ah, uh, that's a giant swamp. There's got to be a bunch of stuff out there. Ah, uh, that's disappointing. I don't like worlds with big swamps. They make me sad and want to cry. Okay, um, we need to get some more food up in here. There's a carrot up there, but I'm not bothering to walk to it because I'm lazy. Um, hey, hey, that means there's a thing over here. Aha! And a spear should be over here as well. There's our spear. Um, gnome box thing and our spear. And loads of carrots around this parts. Around these parts, there be loads of carrots. Alright, um, let's get back over here to the edge and finish getting an outline of these islands. Don't, butterflies, don't! Those dark flowers will consume your souls! It's a terrible fate. All right, get some more flowers. Mm -mm -mm. All right, um, we're seriously getting really close to starting to starve, which is not a good thing, especially since the title implies that we shouldn't. Um, okay, hopefully we'll run into some more carrots, cause I'm not gonna dis I'm not gonna stray from our path. We oh crap! Dang it! The fact that we can see this over here means that this is gonna be a giant freaking bit over there. Dang it! Oh well, that should be the last giant bit, because that's the last attaching part to the world that we've found so far. So hopefully, that'll be the last giant bit, but then again, I could be totally wrong. Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Very productive episode here. Very productive. Alright, I'm glad that we found one of those. Now that, now that we have that, we can, you know, sort of mess around and goof off a little bit. And not be quite so serious, because, you know, being serious is never fun. Okay, so these worlds, these bits attach. So we'll go ahead, um, we've already explored that, so we'll go ahead and go down here. Um, that's the way we should be going anyways. This will help us get the outline the fastest way possible. And hopefully, this will be, oh crap. Um, maybe we should go over here. I believe the piggies had, a, hey. Hey, look. Now we're finding all the stuff this episode. I guess we just didn't look hard enough. Well, actually, I went right by that last episode. Um, oh well. That's fine. It's fine. Um, I believe you pigs had some food, and I would like it, but I'm not going to come and get it because I'm a lazy bum. We can always eat a mandrake if we really need something. Um, I'd rather not, but, you know, it's not It's not that big a deal if we eat a mandrake. It's just one mandrake. It is kind of a lifesaver later on, but, you know, your balls do it. Balls to everything. Alright, um, this might actually not be as long as I had previously thought. Hopefully it won't be. I would like to find some more dead guys or traps, though, because that would be nice to get those extra items. Especially if we could find a winter trap. That would be really helpful. Then we could, you know, do very well. Oh, crap. We need to get some grass. Well, luckily we're in the perfect place to get grass. Um, are there any beefalo out here? Beefalo, reveal yourselves. Show yourselves on there you are. Hey, hey, Bayfalo, what's going on? Show yourself unto me, you have. Alright, um, let's go ahead and get some more grass as well. As it comes along, we'll grab it. And we really need to stop and get some food as well. Crap. Um, yeah, it's kind of looking like we might starve to death if we stay out here. So let's go ahead and start heading back. I'd, I would eat a man, Jake, but, you know, I'd rather not waste it. So we might as well go back up here, check and see if there's any food. And I believe those pigs had some carrot farms or something like that. Um, just eat that crap. That's not very helpful. Get away from me, Bonnie. Get away. Get away. Um, man, our axe is about to break, too. I didn't realize that. Bonnie, Bonnie, Bonnie. There's loads of beef low over here. This actually might be a pretty decent place to set up our base as well. It's it's fairly close to those pigs. It's got a connecting uh, path to the pig king, which would be... Uh, it just makes for faster travel. Um, then again... Maybe we should set up by the pig king, and then we can come over here to the beef low, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, okay. I need foods. I need this. There's a small little, uh, swamp here, so we're gonna have to run across that. Do, 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 do. I can't see the path. I can't see the path, but I think I'm on it. Hey! Hey, it's one of the, it's one of the circle things. One of the, the mushroom circles. It's the blue mushroom circle. That thing. I don't know what they're called, but they're mushroom circle things. That's what they are. So, there you go. Um, Alright, did you guys have... Yes, you did. Alright, sweet. We can go ahead and get ourselves some of these. I think we'll just take three. You know, we don't want to totally kill the pigs, but, you know, we do want to take some of their food. Okay, um... Eat it. There you go. Alright, so let's go ahead and I think we'll go ahead and keep exploring down here a little ways. Um, we got some berries to eat got some stuffs to eat so we're gonna go around the left side here this time although there are spiders over here we're gonna have to be a bit careful um, but this way we'll just make more ground that way we don't have to walk all the way over there to continue what we are doing that way we can just meet up where we left off kind of um, hey hey spider hey, spider spider I just want berries 
I just want berries. Okay, I just wanted the freaking berries. Just get away from me. Um, this might not actually be the best way to go. Crap. All right, here goes nothing. Across the swampy lands, across the swampy lands we go. Where we end up? I really hope somewhere good. Crap. All right. Um. Well, this isn't terrible. We gotta go around these stupid spider nests that are freaking everywhere, though. Oh, great. It's going off to the left. That's exactly what I want. No, it's not. Go away, spiders! So many spiders. Piggy, come out and help me. Peggy, I need your assistance. Alright, this looks like a pretty good place to stop for the night. I like this place. There's not spiders, which is the main concern at this moment. Alright, let's go ahead and break our axe. We don't really need it. Um, it's just kind of hogging space in our inventory right now. There we go. Shut up, spider. I don't even know where you are. I can't even see you. Oh, you're all the way up there. What are you doing? Do you really want something from me? It's my fire. You cannot have it. Go away. It's a piece of crap. Alright, um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Don't Starve, though. It is time to leave you guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Um, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share more Don't Starve coming tomorrow, and of course the next day, and the next day, and forever and ever. No, I'm kidding. Probably eventually we'll stop, you know. But then again, I've been saying that for quite some time, and you know, it still hasn't happened, so. I guess that ha that's how that works out. Um, let's go ahead and get ourselves an axe rail fast. Uh, apparently that just decided it didn't want us to have a fire, so. We are screwed. Um, make yourself... No! No! No, 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 no! I gotta make this... Ah, ha, ha, ha! Ah, ha, ha! Ah, ha, ha, ha! Ah, ha, ha, ha! Alright, I win. Um, that's not exactly how I planned on that happening. Uh, but I suppose it's better than nothing. Um, alright, I'm trying to get back to the edge of the island so that we can keep walking in the general direction that we were throughout the night, um, because I don't like this place. Whoa! Okay, just walk right around that. That's fine. That's fine. Um, I can't see a thing. I can't see a bloody thing, spider! Not a bloody thing! Alright, oh, don't hurt me, you piece of crap. Alright, well, luckily that wasn't as big as I, uh, thought it could have been, so, you know, we, we got pretty lucky there. Um, <laughs> didn't get lucky with those freaking spiders, though. Safety torch saves our butts again! Um, alright, get our axe back out, and now we can go around this left side here. Holy crap, this is gonna be huge. Dang it. I mean, look, it goes off in, like, completely opposite directions. That means it's gotta go all the way around and meet up, or maybe, you know, it can just go at a square angle <laughs> right there, and totally say balls to pretty much everything I said. Um, alright, so, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Don't Starve, though. Of course, we will blow our weekly, or a daily balloon. A daily balloon with Wes. Yes, alright. <laughs> Be sure to like, subscribe, and share. This has been the 8-Bit Ninja with Mortal Starve. Peace out, the 8-Bit Ninja.